So what is Piston Slap and why is my car making this noise? Today we're tearing down this Elantra engine, came out of a 2015 Hyundai Elantra and I'm going to show you why Piston Slap makes that weird noise. Okay, so Piston Slap, what is it? Why does it happen? And why does it make that rattly knocking noise? This engine right here came out of a 2015 Hyundai Elantra and if any of you guys have owned Elantra, you know this noise, you've heard it. Piston slap is when your piston rocks back and forth in the cylinder, the side of the piston or the skirt will scrub on the cylinder wall and while this happens very fast as the piston is coming up and it creates this rattle or knock. This car had piston slap real bad, it was really loud, I'll insert a clip here of this car. So let's get all these accessories took off to the bare engine and we'll start taking it apart. Also this engine only had 80 something thousand kilometers on it, which is crazy because that's not a lot of kilometers. Off comes the knock sensor. Four coils. Off comes the alternator which is still in good shape. I'll probably sell this. Off comes the water pump. One, two oil control valves. Crank pulley. And before you go and making fun of my engine stand, I know it's not ideal, it's a little bit tall for me, but my father-in-law actually made this about 30 years ago. So I'm gonna use it. Off comes the top pan, or the valve cover gasket, whatever you wanna call it. Crank sensor. Oil pressure sensor, take off the oil filter. Pop off the oil pan. She definitely got some metallic flakes down in her. See all those metallic flakes? I'm wondering if this had more issues than just the piston slap. But look at them all. See it now? The car that this came out of, I actually drove like 300 kilometers to get home with that car. It ran and drove fine, aside from the little bit of a knock and come from the engine, but yeah, I actually drove this thing 300 kilometers home. Off comes the timing cover. is actually really dirty considering how low kilometers it had on it. I mean, you look down here, this is pure sludge. I can actually scratch it off with my fingernails. Off comes the tensioner. Off come the guides. Off comes the timing chain. So this engine right here is almost in three pieces. You got the top piece here, which holds the two camshafts. You got the head, and then you got the block. Oh, let's get these cams out. Now, if you were doing this to put it back together, you'd want to take all this apart, kind of in like crisscross, back and forth motion. But in our case right now, it doesn't really matter.
pop out all your head bolts. And now we can pop off the head. Perfect. Off comes the head. Now let's just pop off this gasket. Be careful not to cut yourself because these things are literally like razor blades. So if you look in here, you can see that scoring on the cylinder. That's really bad. You can actually catch your fingernail on that. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn this engine upside down. I'm going to pop those pistons out and we can get a better look at cylinders and the pistons. Off comes the pickup tube. Take off the connecting rod bolt. Oh my god, yeah this one was, oh my god, that one was really bad. So right off the bat, you can see all of the scoring on the skirts of these pistons. Come around to the other side here, that's where it gets real interesting. You're not horrible, not horrible, this one's pretty bad. Whoa, look at this one, that is really bad. It's crazy that I drove this thing 300 kilometers to get it home with this engine in it. And that's why all the fallings are in the base pan. So, piston number one, number two, number three, and number four. Number four is absolutely toasted, man. Look at that. Oh my, that is so bad. I'm amazed that this thing was still running as good as it was. This is back to cylinder number four. Look at how bad that is. That is crazy. All of them are like it too. Even the rod bearing on cylinder number four was getting bad. So that's it for this video. We disassembled this old Elantra engine. This came out of a 2015 Hyundai Elantra with real bad piston slap. And by looking at these pistons in the cylinders, I'm actually amazed that this car ran and drove as well as it did. It drove fine on the highway when you're on the gas, running perfect. As soon as you come to a stoplight or a stop sign, when you come to a stop, it would chop off. So what is piston slap, you're asking? Piston slap is when this piston goes up and down in the cylinder, but it's rocking back and forth the entire time. And that's what creates all the scoring on the cylinders and the gouges on the skirts of the pistons. That's it for this video. Please like and subscribe. Now I just gotta clean all this stuff up. I just love that for me.